If you are wondering how to maintain your pools and prepare them for your hermit crabs, I think you clicked on the right video. Now let's get into it. In this video, this metal bowl is going to be serving as our sink since we're not filming around an actual sink. However, if you do have a sink near you, we would recommend that you use it. To make safe fresh water for your hermit crabs, for every one half gallon, use one half teaspoon of prime. Use some sort of bowl and pour in the fresh water to three-fourths full. Dump your shells into the strainer and put the strainer into the water. Rinse your shells in the water. Scrub and dry each shell or rock individually and lay it to dry on a towel. Rinse out the dish inside to get the sand off of the sides and do the same to the outside. On the salt, let's pour it. I'm going to do repeatedly of what we just did with the fresh water to the salt water. We put a, a fresh and salt mark on our bowls to make sure that we know which one is which. So make sure that your pools are deep enough so that your crabs can fully submerge. Make sure that the crabs can get out. And we put in little ladders and we zip tie them. And we even cut a hole in the side to make sure that they're sturdy. And we also put shells in the bottom so they can have traction on the bottom. For our ladders, we use just plastic canvas. I'm arranging the shells and rocks in the bottom in a way that will make the ladder sturdy and so that they do not slip. Make sure whenever you have pools, let's say this was your pool, you want to put it in the same container because crabs like to mold on top under the water pools all the time. Or make sure to have your pool at the very bottom of the tank. Some people also like to put their uh, pools up on top of shelves in the tank. If you have unfiltered pools, make sure to change them out one to two times a week. If you do have filtered pools, we recommend that you change them out every one to two weeks. We really, really ask that you make sure that the pool fits the size of your tank. Like you don't want a two gallon pool if you have a 40 gallon tank. Just remember that the bigger the pool, the more humidity it will make, and humidity can grow mold easier, but it's, it's not harmful to your crabs. Just make sure to pay attention to mold growing on anything. And let's get to putting the bowls into the tank. Make sure to watch for our next video coming out next Wednesday on how to make water for your hermit crabs.